Hello guys. Today we are going to discuss about swap two numbers using call by reference and using pointers. Let us move to the program. First, insert the header files. That is hash include stdf.h and hash include iostream. Here iostream means its input output stream. Next, we insert the function. It named as swap. In in the in the function, we are passing the arguments int pointer p and int pointer q. The star represents the pointer variable. Next, by calling temporary variable t, we are storing the value. Of pointer p to t, same as pointer p to pointer q, and pointer q to t. In next step, we are displaying the output in the function section. In C out we are displaying the value of A that is assigned to pointer P and value of B that is represented by pointer Q. Pointer represent the address of the variables. Next, we move on to the void main section. In void main, we are declare we are declaring the variable int a comma b. So we are reading the values of a and b. So enter the values of a and b. In C out section and see in a b. So another line we are adding before swapping that it represent the values before swapping which is assigned to A and B. Next line B is equal to B. So in next line, we are calling the function swap, swap of ampersand a and ampersand b. The ampersand represents the reference to the variables in function. So next, build the solution. After successfully solution build, go to debug and start without debug. So it asks to enter the values of A and B. So here we are entering 7 and 5. 7 is for A and 7 5 is for B. After swapping, it changes 5 and 7. Now let us see how the program will work. By placing breakpoint in int t is equal to pointer p, start debugging. So it starts to debugging, that is tracing. By using fun functional keys f10, we move, we move step by step. First enter the values of A and B. 
so it prints before stacking values that is a is equal to 6 and b is equal to 8 so here yeah. in local sections it is changing observe the locals in below